Hello everyone, welcome back. There's a viewer who requested a video of the lunar boots to be made. Shout out to Robbie. He's the one who requested for the video. Ever since this picture surfaced of Rick Owens and Michelle, and Rick was wearing these crazy boots, I immediately knew I had to own them. The version Rick is wearing is a nylonish material with a piss sole. I don't know if it's an unreleased version, but there you go. However, I opted for the pony hair ones instead. I've not worn it out yet because of the country I live in, it is a hassle to travel right now as well. It is from the fall winter 21 season, Gassame. Although it is not featured on the runway, it definitely is a statement piece from Rick. Let's get right into the unboxing right now. So in terms of unboxing, it is the same as always. You have your usual books and whatnot, a tote bag, and some paper stuffings. You can find more information on the sticker here. There is the coat, the size, and it's made in Italy. Now that we've come to the end of the unboxing, let's get the box out of the way so we can check the boots out in detail. The boots are covered in pony hair and made in cow skin. It is of a mid-calf height. It is also heavily padded, but do not let that fool you in terms of sizing. It has the mega lace lacing system. There are 8 eyelets on each side of the shoe and one in the middle to secure the boot with seal coloured laces. The lace are non-functional for me as it's more of a slip-in kind of boot for me. The shaft is white and the boot is kind of a chunky silhouette. It features a shiny tractor sole. Note that although the sides are shiny, the bottom is actually matte. I really wish they made this in the matte sole, but it is what it is. On my first video on YouTube, I showcased the difference between the shiny and the matte tractor sole, and how you can preserve yours if yours ever wear out. There is a huge leather panel running behind the boots. There is a coat and size on the inside of the shaft. There is also a Rick Owens branding on the insole. And as for sizing, I'm usually a size 42, but I went a size down and it works for me. The heel to toe measurement is approximately 27cm, and as for comfort, it is extremely comfortable and soft. To sum up my thoughts on this pair of boots, it feels like a pair of snow boots and pillows on your feet. Let's check out some close-up shots of the boots. Now that I've covered everything about the boots, let's see some fits. I don't have winter in my country, it is summer 365 days a year, but I'll try to emulate winter fits. 